A very good morning to all my dear students. This is Hajira Ahmed, your English teacher for class 1. Welcome to our term 3 virtual learning classes. In today's class, we will be starting term 3 reader. You have brown color term 3 reader children. Be ready with that. Our first lesson we are going to start today. First watch the video carefully, then understand the video. and you have to write your class work too so children be ready the beautiful thing about learning is that nobody can take it away from you okay children so be always ready to learn new things yes children welcome to another class of english what do you see in this picture what is it can anybody guess it it's a round what children it is made up of clay or mud it is brown in color what is it it is a pot okay it is round or cylindrical container used for cooking okay children it is used for cooking food it is round in shape and we can also keep something in this we can preserve food okay children or we can fill up water and keep it in the kitchen it is used in the kitchen to store food or water so our today's lesson is also about a pot our lesson name is the magic porridge pot so take out your term 3 readers and be ready on page number 7 The magic porridge pot. A little girl meets an old woman. The old woman gives her a magic porridge pot. Cook, little pot, cook, says the old woman. The little pot cooks some porridge. Stop, little pot, stop, says the old woman. The little pot stops cooking. The little girl takes the magic porridge pot to her mother. Cook, little pot, cook, says the little girl's mother. The little pot cooks some porridge. Soon, the kitchen is full of porridge. Still, the magic porridge pot goes on cooking. Soon the house is full of porridge still the magic porridge pot goes on cooking soon the whole town is full of porridge still the magic porridge pot goes on cooking stop little pot stop says the little girl at last the magic porridge pot stops cooking but the whole town is still eating porridge yes children your term readers third term readers page number 7 you have to take out page number 7 our first lesson is the magic porridge pot right today's date it's 18th january 2021 okay children here you can see in this picture it's a pot pot is a round and cylindrical container it is used for cooking purposes okay children okay we can store uh, food items in this and we can fill water in this it is used for various purposes okay and you have to join the dots and you have to color the pot these are few pebbles kept under it so you have to color the pebbles also shall we start our lesson yes Yes a little girl meets an old woman the old woman gives her a magic porridge pot what does the girl do the girl meets an old woman and the old woman gives a pot to the girl cook little pot cook says the old woman the little pot cooks some porridge okay children 
the old woman says cook little pot cook okay the little pot cooks some porridge what is porridge over here children the old woman says cook let cook some porridge porridge means a dish made of oats or cereals boiled in water or milk okay children it's a type of food we eat in the breakfast so the little pot cooks some porridge stop little pot stop says the old woman what does the old woman say stop to the pot okay the little pot stops cooking it, as soon as the old woman says the pot stopped the cooking the little girl takes the magic magic porridge pot to her mother cook little pot cook says the little girl's mother as soon as the girl takes the pot to the mother mother says cook little pot cook the little pot cooks some porridge the pot started cooking the porridge soon the kitchen is full of porridge when the mother was cooking the pot didn't stop cooking it was continued making porridge so the kitchen was full of porridge it was overflowing still the magic porridge pot goes on cooking soon the house is full of porridge the pot was not stopping cooking so the house was also full of porridge it was overflowing so much that the first the kitchen was full then the house was full of porridge turn the page still the magic porridge pot goes on cooking the pot was cooking more and more soon the whole town is full of porridge what do you mean by town children what do you mean by town town is a place larger than a village and smaller than a city okay it is a small town where the town was full of porridge firstly the kitchen was full of porridge then the house was full of porridge then the whole town is full of porridge still the magic porridge pot goes on cooking still it was cooking stop little pot stop says the little girl what does the little girl says the little girl said stop little pot stop at last the magic porridge pot stops cooking okay when the little girl said stop little pot stop the ma magic porridge pot stopped cooking but the whole town is still eating porridge the good thing was the whole town was eating and enjoying the porridge isn't it a good story i liked it very much hope you all enjoyed the story i hope you all have understood the story it's a good story read it twice so that it will be easy for you to understand it better now open your english class works and write today's date as 18 january 2021 term 3 lesson 1 the magic porridge pot okay children the heading should be on the red margin line our subheading is new words today we are going to read the lesson as well as we are going to write the new words okay children first one is w o m a n woman m a g i c magic p o r r i d g e porridge as i told you it is a type of cereal it is a type of breakfast made with the cereal and oats c o o k cook m o t h e r mother k i t c h e n kitchen m a k i n g making t o w n town w h o l e hole 
L I T T L E little E A T I N G eating O L D old M E E T meat S T O P stop G I R L girl S O O N soon S T I L L still F U L L full E N J O Y enjoy C A L L E D called okay children in this way you are going to write the new words read and write the new words in your english classwork once again i repeat today's homework is to read the lesson page number 7 and 8 and write the new words in your classwork one time i request all the students to read and write the new words so that it will be easy for you to spell out and remember the words thank you have a good day bye